Welcome back, Patriots. Today is Wednesday, February 26th, and this is your Patriot Press News. I'm Sophie Rodriguez, and this is your morning announcements. This week is National FFA Week, and in honor of this, we at your campus FFA chapter will be bringing you this, the news this week along with the news. We want to share history with you as well. In 1935, a program known as the New Farmers of America was formed for young African-American boys to learn to be involved in vocational agriculture. 30 years later, in 1965, NFA merged with FFA, increasing FFA membership by more than 50,000. In 1947, Fred McClure became the first African-American National FFA officer. And in 1994, Corey Florey was elected as the first African-American National FFA president. And in 2017, Brenna Holbert was elected into office and became the first African-American female to be a national president. In honor of National FFA Week, this week Heritage FFA is hosting our chapter agri-science fair. Come check out the projects that our students have spent all semester working on and cast your ballots for staff favorite project. The AgriScience Fair will be held after school today from 3.10 to 4.10 p.m. at the ARC. NHS meetings are being moved to lunch. The first NHS meeting of the semester is today during both lunches in W205. Make sure to get there quickly, as there is a lot to discuss. Attention working students, now is the time to file your taxes. If money was taken out of your check in taxes, odds are you can get that money back if you file. Need help? Contact Ms. Stifler in room L107 in the mornings or just email her to set up a time to meet. International Pink Shirt Day is today and there will be music, in, uh, music and lunchtime games in the quad. Make sure to head over and join in on the fun. Your Interact Club is having a meeting this Thursday. First lunch in, in W103 and second lunch in band room R148. Heritage High Dance Team presents their 13th annual dance showcase on March 12th and 13th at 7 p.m. Doors open at 6.30. Tickets are $8 pre-sale starting March 9th in ASB and $10 at the door. Seniors, if you want to attend the FAFSA Fiesta and get an extra graduation ticket, make sure you submit your FAFSA by March 2nd. This Saturday, we will have FAFSA slash CATA assistance from 8 to 12 in the College and Career Center in the library. Hey guys, it's David here. I just wanted to let you know that Patriot Olympics is starting back up again. It's going to be held on March 20th. Registration is open all the way from now all the way until February 28th. For more information, you can visit ASB Counseling R143 or you can refer back to your email for more information posted there. Make sure when you're registering, you have at least six or more people to form a team. For more information, you can go ahead and visit those sites. I'll see you guys there. Trying to win the championship. Hi, my name is Mr. Gregory and I started out at Northern Arizona University and then I transferred to University of Northern Colorado where I got my BA and then I did my master's degree at Cal State San Bernardino and I also uh, cleared my credential through University of Phoenix. My final major was math, but that was my fifth major. My first major was uh, business and then I switched to geology and then hydrology and then civil engineering for a few years and then finally into mathematics. The campus was really big. It was about a mile and a half long by about a half a mile wide and there was a bus service uh, that ran and cloud. between periods there was a 10 minute passing period and so if you jumped right on the bus, you could make it to class if you were in North Campus and needed to go to South Campus. But if you were, say, in Central Campus, you could walk to North Campus or South Campus in time because there was three campuses separated by the mountains. I did lots of extracurricular activities at Northern Arizona University. I was part of a group of guys that tried to win the intramural championship in all sports. So I did intramural football, intramural basketball, intramural softball, intramural broomball, uh, intramural soccer, uh, intramural ping pong, and intramural, intramural horseshoes, and intramural volleyball all I, while I went to college. Plus I was a resident assistant, plus I was elected to student government for two years as a, as a, uh, a person that represented my dorm.
that's our announcements for today, Patriots. Have a great day, and we will see you tomorrow.